Welcome to my opinion here and my opinion TV. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click the notification bell. So as soon as a video is released, you'll be one of the first to be notified. And today we're going to play a clip as it relates to the Jamaican soccer player, Jashawn Anglin, who is before the courts in America. He's a player who represented Jamaica in 2020 against Bermuda, Bermuda, Bermuda sorry, and he represents Miami FC. And he's been charged for sexual assault in, in court. Now we're going to turn this over to NBC, a clipping from NBC, as it relates to what transpired with Jashon. But based on what we are reading, you know, it doesn't really look good on his path. We hope he has a good representative who will help in his case if he's not guilty. But as you all know, when a woman says no, it's no. It doesn't matter how you feel. Once she said no, is no. And once you take it before the authorities, more than likely you'll be penalized for that. Because at the end of the day, you have to respect someone's right when they tell you no. And sometimes even when they tell you yes, that yes means no. And at the end of the day, there are so many relationships, there are so many issues that go awry sometimes. And when it goes awry, the quickest way to sink a male is by saying they sexually assault you. We don't know what's the situation. We are not here to judge the situation. We are just here to watch and see what will take place. But Joshon Anglin, we hope that you'll come through this. And we hope if you are not guilty, the court will find you not guilty. But my brother, if you are guilty, it doesn't really look good on your behalf. But watch this video and you'll hear what the NBC has to say about this entire situation. Until next time, stay safe. Keep on locked on My Opinion TV. Welcome back. A minor league soccer player is behind bars. Investigators say 20-year-old Jay Sean Anglin of Miami FC sexually assaulted a woman on FIU's campus. NBC 6's Johnny Archer is live in Southwest Miami Day with the disturbing details of accusations that athlete is now facing. Johnny. Jackie and Juwan, good evening to you both. The victim is a student here at FIU, and Anglin is accused of sexually assaulting her inside one of the school buildings. Now, Anglin's team, Miami FC, they play on FIU's campus here in one of the stadiums, but police have no idea why he was here in the middle of the night. Police say this Miami FC soccer player sexually assaulted an FIU student inside a campus building. Wednesday morning, Jashawn Anglin stood before a Miami Dade judge. I live in Jamaica, but I, I, co I came up here playing soccer. You for came Miami. for a sporting event. Okay, so just so you know, in America, well, you're here seven months. Yeah. Okay. In America, no means no. Police say England started a conversation with a woman around midnight Tuesday. He convinced her to go inside this building on main campus. And that's when police say England began sexually assaulting her. A custodian working that night heard what was happening inside the classroom and came to help the student, who police describe as in her 20s. I don't know what I would have done in that instance, but... I would have, like, ran or me. I don't know. England was acquired to Miami FC in January. Shortly after, the Jamaican star published an article about his past, describing him as falling under bad influences and picking up bad habits. The article writing England was given a second chance to play soccer after coming to Miami. But now that second chance could come to an end. England is convicted of the crime that has some students on edge at FIU. That's the danger, especially with someone that you don't know. And police say the two did not know each other and consider this an isolated situation. Right now, England is being held on a $10,000 bond. Reporting from FIU, Johnny Archer, NBC6.